This May marks the 100th anniversary of the United States House of Representatives passing a resolution granting women the right to vote. Central Lakes College is celebrating Women's History Month throughout the month of March to commemorate the achievements women have made throughout history. Reporter Rachel Johnson has more. The cafeteria at Central Lakes College was packed Wednesday as CLC kicked off a month of celebration and events for Women's History Month. Just like hope springing high, still I'll rise. Women's History Month is a tradition at CLC. Well, I think this is a great time to just celebrate the progress that's been made with women's history and then just keep a focus on the future and on how we need to continue to come together and, and um, work on progress. The kickoff event showcased various speakers who talked about the significance of yellow roses and the color white with the women's suffrage movement. CLC is hosting a multitude of events throughout the month of March, starting with March 19th with the history of birth control. The events begin after CLC's spring break and include everything from workshops on culture and poetry to a talk on making a difference in the world of sex trafficking. We have some American Indian um, people coming in to talk about um, culture and poetry, and then we have some, some of our own faculty and staff uh, facilitating different workshops. CLC is partnering with many community organizations throughout the month, one of them being the American Association of University Women. We try to live out our mission of empowering younger women and giving them opportunities for educational equity. Administrators at CLC know the importance of celebrating women's achievements in history. The month of March and focusing on women's history gives us an opportunity to look at all of the things that have been accomplished by women, um, the number of things that have had to, you know, happen through legislation. The college believes that it is important to have conversations and honor women's history with not only students but community members as well. We need to teach these stories and we need to teach her story to our students, to one another. We all need to learn um, these very important stories and contributions. Reporting from Brainerd, Rachel Johnson, Lakeland News. All the Women's History Month events at CLC are open to the public, and for a full list of events, you can visit the story on our website, lptv.org. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.